Cheryl Lee Ralph is easily one of the most accomplished actors of our generation. This woman and her amazing career is the very blueprint of black excellence. From her captivating smile, larger than life on-screen presence, and her philanthropic efforts is a jewel in our crown. After 40 years in the limelight, her star is brighter than ever. This singer, actress, producer, Forbes 50 over 50 honoree, and award-winning queen has no doubt reached legendary status. Cheryl Lee Ralph, born in Connecticut, but this queen reps Jamaica to the fullest. Her father is a college professor, and her mother, a fashion designer, is responsible for the iconic Kariba suit. Between her upbringing in Jamaica and Long Island, New York, Miss Black Teenage New York was also the youngest woman to graduate Rutgers University at the age of 19. Cheryl would go on to win the Irene Ryan Acting Scholarship from the Kennedy Center American College Theater Festival. It was all up from there. The star began her film career under the direction of Sidney Poitier in 1977 in the comedy A Piece of the Action. Just a few years later, Cheryl would continue growing a resume full of award-winning roles. Joining Jennifer Holliday, Loretta Devine, Ben Harney, Cleavon Derricks, Vondi Curtis Hall, and Oba Babantunde in the Broadway play Dream Girls. Ralph's role as Dina Jones in Dreamgirls earned her a Tony Award for Best Actress in a Musical in 1982. In 1989, Cheryl would land her first leading role as Lola Quinn, wife to Denzel Washington's character in The Mighty Quinn. The following year, Ralph won the Independent Spirit Award for Best Supporting Female for her performance in the 1990 drama film To Sleep With Anger, co-starring Mary Alice and Danny Glover. While working with Robert De Niro in 1992, he gave her some words of wisdom she carried throughout her career. I was thinking the other day, I did a film with Robert De Niro called Mistress. And one day Robert said to me in between takes, he said, you are good. He said, like you're award winning, good. But Hollywood is not looking for the black actress. They're not looking for you. So you better climb that mountain, wave the red flag and let them know that you're there. She's been waving that flag ever since. While in real life, Cheryl is a mom of two. We've seen her be mom on screen to some of our biggest stars. In 1993, she played Lauren Hill's mother in Sister Act 2, Back in the Habit. She earned five nominations for the NAACP Image Award for Outstanding Supporting Actress in a Comedy Series, where she starred as Brandy's mother, Dee Mitchell, and Moesha. Then, in 2013, Cheryl was cast in NBC Smash with fellow dream girl Jennifer Hudson as her mother. Later in the same year, Cheryl co-starred in Nickelodeon and TV Land's Instant Mom, alongside Tia Mowry as her mom, Maggie, for three seasons. On top of her tremendous film and television success, Cheryl never lost her love of the theater. Since her appearance in 1981's Dreamgirls, Cheryl's gone on to star in several stage productions, including Goosebumps the Musical, Wicked, and Thoroughly Modern Millie. In 2021, Cheryl applied her talent to producing Thoughts of a Colored Man, the first Broadway play to be written, directed, starring, and led, produced by black men. The award winner also makes sure to shine a spotlight on the AIDS community with her foundation, Diva Simply Singing, a musical tribute to friends and colleagues she's lost to HIV, AIDS. For over 30 years, Ralph produced the show, featuring several stars, including Faith Evans, Layla Hathaway, and Kenny Lattimore. Recently, the organization has donated over $30 million to benefit members of the LGBTQ community, women and children. Still fine after all this time. The 65-year-old slayed the runway earlier this year when she killed the catwalk on Rihanna's latest Savage Fenty show, Volume 4, in 2022. My publicist called, my manager called, uh, my son, I don't know how he finds out about all of these things, but he's always on the pulse. And he was like, you're gonna get a phone call from Rihanna. You're gonna get a phone call. They're gonna call you. You're gonna be doing the Savage show. It's gonna happen, it's gonna happen. This is gonna be big, mom. And I was just like, every time my son says that to me, it's gonna be big. Yeah, so it's, it's been great. 
After 40 years in Hollywood, Cheryl won an Emmy for Outstanding Supporting Actress in a Comedy Series for her role in Abbott Elementary. Only the second black actress to win in the category after Jack A. Harry for 227 in 1987. Cheryl got all the flowers she so long deserved. Talk about good company. This year, Ralph was also honored by her motherland of Jamaica when she was given the title of Honorable Cheryl Lee Ralph. An award-winning career, hit television and film credits, years of successful philanthropy, and a host of new fans for her current day achievements, Cheryl Lee Ralph is gold in every bit of legendary status. Mm -hmm.